We're here at Fassler Hall. I got my friend. We're gonna get in here and try some of this amazing food from Fassler Hall and some Anthem beers. Yum. and she is gonna walk us through this incredible feast we've got going on here before us. So uh, yeah, just give us the rundown here if you don't mind. Awesome, so uh, starting off with this, this is our table board. It's on the menu, it's the feed the table option. It's gonna come with uh, four pretzels, Dusseldorf mustard, smoked Gouda cheese sauce, french fries, a whole roasted chicken, six sausages of choice, and sauerkraut. Here we've got the uh, Italian jalapeno cheddar, habanero chicken, hunter sausage, cheddar worst and bratwurst wow. sausage. Um, after That's that, crazy. we've got the pork shank over here with a braised red cabbage, uh, a roasted chicken salad with apples, blue cheese, and a mustard vinaigrette. And then over here is the schnitzel dinner, breaded pork loin with a mushroom gravy, mushroom uh, sweet potato spatzel. Um, doesn't really taste like sweet potato, but we make it that way so it's gluten free. Oh, nice. Uh, Parmesan cheese on top, and it's served with lemon wedges. Beautiful. Wow. That is that is quite an impressive uh, bounty of food we've got going this on. This is a little <laughs> overwhelming for the eyeballs, but it looks amazing. Yeah. So we're gonna see how much of this we can get into our in here. Good Stick luck. around for the rest Thank of Fassler Hall. <laughs> Fassler your seat belts. Because we're about to eat all, all of this, this food. food. With these delicious Anthem beers. Two. Do you want to start with here, buddy old boy? Buddy old boy Start with here. the pronzels from Germany. Pronzels? I want to try with the pronzels from Germany. We're going to try these pronzels. They're from Germany. It's very grainy mustard. Mm. Very good. Very grainy. Yeah. It's very got good. a nice uh, spice to it. Ooh. A little horseradish in there, maybe. Yeah. Maybe a little horse apple. Crab apples. Probably not crab apples. It's not a seafood place. No. I'm gonna try some of this cheese sauce. Oh yeah, cheese with the pretzel. That's the way to go. I feel like I'm at a baseball game because I got my baseball shirt and my pretzel. Uh -huh. Take me out to the ball game. Take Dad. me out, Dad. 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 This goes perfect with that because it's this it's this delicious brand new Oktoberfest from Anthem. And dink these chickies? Yeah, I'm gonna dink a chicken wiggy. Goodness. Man. Yeah. Wow. That's really, really, really tender. That is so good. The skin's got a nice little crispiness to it. You know? Juicy, delicious chicken there. The chicken's gotta die. This is the way to turn out. Yeah. I'm sorry you had to die for my mouth, but not really. Because it's lovely and tasty. It's all it can be. Well, I think. I think we have the right idea because we're letting some of the chicken juices drop into the into french the, fries. Into the french fries, okay. So now, now we're on to something. Oh no. Now we're biting chickens. These are really well that, done fries. That cheese. I know, it's almost like you could just eat the cheese by itself. I don't Every really... time I try the cheese, I am reminded of Beer Fest. When that guy screams, hot cheese soup. And then he spills it all over the guy. Oh, that would that would be awful to get hot cheese soup spilled all over you. Spill it in my mouth. Don't spill it on my back. No. I don't want hot cheese on my back anymore. No. Anymore, ever. Again. Not again. Not since that one time. 
Oh my god, look at the juices. Look at this, Cliff. Cliff, look at this. Look at the juices on that. Look at that. Mmm. Man, that's a full on Sunday crock pot yeah. roast. Yeah, your mom couldn't make it that way. Sorry. Sorry, mom. Sorry to tell you. Sorry, mom, mom. I know it looks like an octopus, an octopus, but it's not. I'm gonna get a spooky Halloween wig. This is one of my first real, I think, real German food courses. Yeah. You know, I know one phrase in German. Yeah, it goes, Imusch die Fenster putzen. You know what it means? <laughs> Try to guess. Um, where's the library? No. How many hot dogs do you, can I eat? Close. It means I must wash the windows. Watch or wash? Wash. Mm. Yeah. So you were in Germany doing a bunch of chores. Yeah, I did chores in Germany for about three months, mm -hmm. um, exclusively washing windows because that's the only phrase I could remember. And only work you could get if that's the only yeah, thing you I could didn't say. Get, I didn't get paid because I wasn't asking if I could wash the windows. I was exclaiming that I must. Oh. So <laughs> that's why I got sent back to the United States of America. <laughs> <laughs> Time for, a, time for a sauerkraut party. Sa sauerkraut party. Sauerkraut sausage party. Sauerkraut, 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 sauerkraut party. And hot sauerkraut and sausage party. Oh. <laughs> Dude. Mm. Dude. Okay? Yes, that is wonderful. That is like, I'm, th I'm picking up some peppercorn up in that. Yeah. That's amazing. That's a good wiener. That's a spicy one. Yeah. <laughs> I think this one's a cheddar worst. See the cheddar? Yeah, I see out the out cheddar getting there. Yeah, I got some cheddar worst there. Oh. Oh, wow. This is like a palate cleanser for the weenies. Spice up your life. This one is a spicy one. Did you? Are you on this one? Spiced up my life. That is a spicy weenie. Holy cow! That's the spiciest weenie we've tried so far. It is. It must have a lot of a spice in it. I feel like I've been transported from my real life to a whole different dimension. I feel like we went back to the medieval times. Yeah. And where some we're like regarded as some some, some kind of important people. Yeah. yeah. We walked in and they're like. We're basically like two jesters, but we somehow trick people into thinking we're kings. Exactly. Like, I'm, and I'm he's the main he's the main king, and I'm his king wife. I'm scared of riding horses. Why don't All you right. do a slice on that thing so we can do a bite on it? That's what I got this for. Oh right. Here, hold it steady. Here I go again with my dad. Duh. Cheers. Wow. You this know, is the, the mushroom cordon bleu chicken. Uh, I don't know if that's what it was. What? The schnitzel dinner. Schnitzel dinner. Schnitzel dinner. You know, I'm not usually a mushroom fan, but that gravy is actually very good. Man, a mushroom fan would probably smell weird in your bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Last summer I was trying on a mushroom fan in my room when it got too hot. But hot mushroom is not a good smell. Hot mushroom fan. Are we ready? You want to try dipping it on this salad? It's the appetizer. We uh, probably yeah, should have tried to, it first. But you're supposed to eat a salad before everything else. But this got some yummy chicken in I'm it. I'm gonna try a piece of apple like, first. Get that apple in there. I'm gonna try to get all the elements in one bite. That's what you're supposed to do. You do that, and I'll do one at a time, and we can. Okay. You can say what the ensemble tastes like, and I'll, I'll say what the individual ingredients taste okay, like. Okay, you ready? Yeah, three, one, two, two, three. Three. Blue cheese on its own is like a, whew, it'll slap you in the face. The apple, I don't do a lot of apples with salad, and it's great. All right. Blue cheese, please. Blue cheese for me, please. Is a food coma a real thing? Yeah. Little touch, let's touch tips. It's like a little cock doggy. Mm. Mm. Oh, I got some on my tongue, not in my tongue, on it. That one tastes like more like a traditional sausage, you know? Uh, it's what you call a burp curtain. That's cheese. I'm gonna do a little bite, and then I'm gonna do a big bite with a bunch of that cheese on it. Oh, I like that idea. I like getting the sausage, you buy it, it goes, PAM! 
cheese dip. It's, this is almost like a fondue. Cheese dip. That's where the that's where the, the, the phrase came from. What phrase? Cheese dip. <laughs> oh. Well, my boy. Here's our last weenie. <laughs> my God, the sausage. Weenies. <clears throat> we want to thank Fassler Hall. So much. Bailey for catering all this amazing yeah, food to our faces. Us what it was, because we would have been lost without Ooh, So that many varieties, different things you can get here. They got brunch. They do all these local craft beers, especially from our friends over at Anthem Brewing. Anthem Brewing. Mm. Um, I'm very excited to see what Oklahoma has to offer on our food venture that is We, we Eat Out Oklahoma. Man, it was so delicious. I'm full, as you can tell. Yeah, look at that tongue. Look at this. Got look a food baby in there. Oh, it's stiff. But, uh, we just, yeah, we want to thank everybody here for walking us through the delicious meats and treats. and Absolutely. Stuff I've never tried before, and I'm thankful I got to try it. Yeah, me too. So if you haven't been to Fassler Hall, get your buns down here. Get your buns down here. Get some sausages in your mouth. We eat about Oklahoma. We eat about Oklahoma. Oklahoma. There's so much food to eat in Oklahoma.